Sarah, Sarah gonna draw Spooky Kitty. <laughs> We've drawn kittens before, but we've never drawn a scary kitty. Well, it's really not going to be a scary kitty. It's just going to be a cute one. Yeah. But it's going to show us bones. Yes. <laughs> we hope you're going to follow along with us. you got a marker or something to draw with, some paper, and at the very end, we're going to color it. Yes. You ready to start? Yeah. <laughs> All right. First step, let's draw our kitten's nose right in the middle of our paper. We're going to draw a V like that, a really teeny V. V. Yeah, and then we're going to connect the top. Then we're going to draw a J for the mouth and a backwards J for the other side. Could be a curved W too. Mm. <laughs> now let's draw our kitten's eyes. We're going to draw a circle over here and we're going to draw a circle on the left. And we want them to be the same size. Yeah, good. Now let's color in those circles. Next, we're going to draw our kitten's head, and we're going to draw, watch this, we're going to start here on the left side, and we're going to draw a shape that comes underneath like this, and then back up on the other side. I saw you add eyelashes. <laughs> <laughs> you thought you were being sneaky. All right, now we're going to draw the top of our kitten's head. We're going to draw a big rainbow <laughs> line that goes over the top to the other side. It's a bald kitty. A bald kitten. Now we're, <laughs> now we're gonna draw, this is the skull. Now we're gonna draw her ribs. We're gonna draw a U shape underneath. So we're gonna start here, we're gonna draw a U like this, and then back up. Looks like a mushroom. Then we're gonna draw her sternum. We're gonna draw another U right in the middle of the first one. Now we're gonna draw her ribs. We're gonna first draw a rainbow line that comes up, connects, and comes back down. Then we're going to add two curved, two more curved lines on the left side and also on the right. It looks like a rib cage. Yeah. Yeah, the ribs. Okay, now we can draw her little paws. We're going to draw a circle on the left and a circle on the right that match. Let's draw her toes. We're going to draw on each circle, we're going to draw a little U like this. It comes down, back, up on the other side. Then we're gonna draw her toes. We're gonna draw two lines inside on the left and also on the right. Okay, now we're gonna do something really cool. We're gonna trace around our kitten. So we're gonna start up here. Watch me, I'm gonna go right next to the shape. Okay, so we're gonna go all the way around and then when we come down here to her body, we're gonna keep going down and then we're gonna trace around her paws. And we're going to go all the way around the shape of our kitten and connect up here at the top. When we fast forward the lesson, or if we go too fast, what can our art friends do? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can always pause the video if you need more time. All right, let's add ears because she doesn't really look like a kitten. Yet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we're going to start over here on the right and let's draw a curve that comes out like that. And we can draw a curve that comes out on the other side. Now she looks like a bunny. A, a bug. Yeah, or a bunny. <laughs> now we're going to draw her big ears coming down like this to her cheek and we'll come down on the other side also. All right, now let's do one more of those shapes inside and we'll do it on the right side also. Now it's kind of starting to look like a kitten, right? Yeah. Let's give her whiskers. One, two, three, and let's do three on the other side also. Now what is she missing? Her tail. Her tail. <laughs> let's draw two curved lines that are gonna come out from the side like this. So there's one, and then we're gonna draw another one right next to it. And I'm getting closer and then touching at the very end. This is her tail, but we're gonna draw little sections so that it looks like bones going down her tail, like that. Bones. Yes, lots of bones. Then we're gonna trace around it just like we did on her body. So we're gonna go all the way around like this and curve around and then connect back into her body. That's a super thick tail. <laughs> <laughs>
We did it, Hadley. We finished drawing our cute little spooky kittens. Now we're not completely done, right? Yeah. What do we still need to do? Color. Yeah, she's gonna look so much better colored in. This part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end you guys can pause it to match the same color. You ready to fast forward? Yes. All right, Hadley, we did it. We finished drawing our little kittens and we colored them too. They look super cute. Now we also added little pumpkins and yours is my favorite. She really looks like she's laughing. She's so cute. <laughs> and then I also added leaves, but you can leave this off to keep the lesson a little easier. We have a lesson that's all about drawing these leaves and we'll leave a link below this video where you can check that lesson out. What else could you add to your drawing to make it more spooky? Bats. Oh, bats would be way cool. You could add a lot of bats. You could also add ghosts in a coffin. Oh. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your cat. Yes, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye! Bye.